united forever in friendship and labor, our mighty republics will ever endure. The great Soviet Union will live through the ages, the dream of a people, their fortress secure. Long live our Soviet motherland, built by the people's mighty hand. Long live our people, united and free, strong in a friendship tried by fire. Long may our crimson flag inspire, shining in glory for all men to see. Through days dark and stormy, while great Lenin led us, our eyes saw the bright sun of freedom above, and Stalin our leader, with faith in the people, inspired us to build a land that we love. Before we start, I think it would only be appropriate for us to remember Ludo. Ludo Martins, as you know, died just recently. Um, there are some bits of paper here which give you some information about him. Uh, he died on 5th of June after a long and lingering illness. He was president of the Workers' Party of Belgium, which we sometimes refer to as the PTB, sometimes it's referred to as the WPB, depending on what language you're using. Together with Paul Gossens and Walter de Bock, Ludo was one of the better known student leaders of the May 1968 students in Belgium. He translated the worldwide progressive current of the universities into the foundation of a student trade union movement which was called the SVB. Developed solidarity with the equal rights movement of black people in the United States, resisted narrow nationalism and exerted efforts to enhance the movement of solidarity between students and workers. In 1979, Ludo Martins was instrumental in founding the Workers' Party of Belgium, born from the merger of the student movement and the workers' movement in the 1970s. Ludo helped to put the principle of serve the people into practice <coughs> by actively stimulating Chris Merckx in setting up medicine for the people. Yes. Today, 11 people's clinics of medicine for the people provide free health care for more than 25,000 patients, and it remains one of the WPB's major achievements. Today, the party counts 4,500 members and has chapters, they call them, in 30 cities and 120 workplaces all over Belgium. Ludo led the WPB until 1999. The last decade of his life was mainly active in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. With his writings about Congolese liberation fighters Patrice Lumumba, Pierre Mulele and Leonie Abo, he wanted to support the progressive movement in the Congo. Returning history to those who made it is what, how he put it. And as Baudouin says in his message, today however Unfortunately, we have to return history itself to Ludo. Ludo Martins is survived by two children, and on Sunday the 26th of June t t today, a simple commemoration is taking place in Brussels. Um, Apal Bra is there taking part in that commemoration. Of course, on behalf of the Stalin Society, we also have some very dear memories of Ludo work with us and Ludo's writings. So we sent a message to the party on behalf of the Stalin Society. <coughs> we sent our condolences to the PTB on the sad passing away of Comrade Ludo on the 5th of June and we sympathise with their great loss. The loss of Comrade Ludo to the international communist movement is also great indeed, not a personal loss. His deep understanding of Marxism-Leninism enabled him to play a highly significant role in the formation of the PTB, in the convening of the international seminars in Brussels, and in many, many aspects of the international movement. The members of the Stalin Society, who come from several different political organisations and backgrounds, have always placed very high regard on Ludo's role in the anti-revisionist movement. 
Since our formation back in 1991, our members have particularly valued his writings such as Another View of Stalin, which deals with so many of the lies perpetrated by the bourgeoisie against Comrade Stalin and the Bill of Socialism. Comrade Ludo's scientific analysis will continue to be a highly valuable component of our movement. We hope and desire that his theoretical understanding, his determination in struggle, and his staunch defence of socialism will continue to inspire us all. Long live Marx and Leninism. Can we stand for a minute's silence to remember Comrade Ludo Martins? Don't you know we're talking about a revolution it sounds whisper? Don't you know we're talking about a revolution it sounds like a whisper? While they're standing in the welfare lines, crying at the doorsteps of those armies of salvation, wasting time 